Hello! Welcome back to Guild Wars with Kitty Katsi. Uh, this should have gone up yesterday, but it didn't. So it's going up today. Sorry about that. I uh, hope it doesn't bother you too much. Uh, we just finished up killing a ton of people and, and jailbreaking some guy, and uh, now we're preparing to rendezvous with the Tribune Desert Grave at Junker Scrapyard. So let's go ahead and do that and get this party started, shall we? And we need to go here. Oh yeah, I guess either one of these waypoints will do. And there's the Death Star, as we remember it. All right. Oh, and if you hadn't, haven't noticed, a uh, new die job uh, since then, since last episode. I, f I like it. It's pretty, pretty suave. I think. Here we are on the on the gear, the gear road, as I like to call it. Mice. Wait. Are they are they men or are they mice? Make up your mind. Can be both. It's impossible. It's it's legitimately impossible to be both men and mouse. Uh, I've tried many times. Man, the music's really sinister now. Woof. Um, uh, just following the green arrows on my mini map. Hey, look, it's a Norn. You can tell he's a Norn because he's like taller than everybody else, even though he's a human-ish sort of thing. Ah! Cubs. I actually think I, um, I'm actually really frightened of the cubs. They just, there's something about them that gives me the heebie-jeebies. They're so small and so, they're so muscular for <laughs> being little cubs. Like, they they literally look like bench pressers, or, or bodybuilders, or whichever you prefer. Uh, is that part of the music? Like, gear grinding sound? No. Must be this machinery. Gearing away. Look, there he goes. I mean, look at that. He's more buff than I am. He's just a little cat. Is this the Junker's Scrapyard? Quite, quite exciting. Here we go. A spy for a spy. Man, those people have some spooky eyes. It looks a little bit like Frankenstein, or like maybe they're they're not real char. They're like dolls, and they're just patched together. Man, do not look down as I look down. Oh, what is that? It's like a jet engine or something. There are old char and old char, but very few bold old char. Wise words. Hey, over here. Oh, it's Sakia, our favorite feet. sleuthing detective. My feet hurt and I'm tired of shooing people away. All right then. Who's all this? We got. We got Riva and Yahook, the sassy uh, cat from the spa, uh, Tripping Torga, Desert Grave, uh, Fingar, who is like the most useless sidekick in the history of sidekicks, and uh, Sakia, the sleuth, or the shrouded, as her title is. But I, I like to call her the sleuth. Hail Tribune, I have information. Flame Legion is going to trick Blood and Iron, making each think the other attacked them. If the plan works, it might break the Citadel's alliance. They're targeting Iron's new weapon, and a Blood Legion Centurion. The whole thing was cooked up by someone named Tribulus Griefblade. I know the name Griefblade. He's real trouble. Blood and Iron need to know now so they can prepare. No. This is an Ash operation. Blood and Iron would make a Drake's breakfast out of it. We'll handle it ourselves. The Legionnaire will take one mission. Fengar can handle the other. <laughs> Fingar can't handle Fengar. anything. Tribune, Fengar's not experienced enough for something this big. I'll do. No, Sakea, your orders are to track down Griefblade. Fengar, you finally got your chance for field duty. Now, Legionnaire, you brought the intel, so we'll make it your call. Guard Iron's engine, or Blood Centurion. Decide and move out. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Well, um, uh, hmm, which one's the most important, I wonder? Guard the Iron's engine, or Blood's Centurion. Uh, what, was the, what was the plan again? They're targeting Iron's new weapon and a Blood Legion Centurion. Uh, I feel like the weapon could be repaired if, if Fingar fails at, at, at his task, uh, whereas, you know, the Centurion, he'd probably die. So we'll, we'll go for defend the blood guy, uh, Tornpaw. 
What a name. Good luck, Fingar. You, uh, you poor, poor cat. Look how small he is. Oh, new great sword. Oh, don't mind if I do. Actually, does more damage. Uh, what's this level? Oh, <gasps> a hat. All right. I'm just gonna equip all this real quickly, and also we have a new aqua breather and two bags of loot. This isn't gonna take long. I'm just gonna press these buttons, and I'm gonna click this, and I'm going to blah blah. Uh, wait, is that spear gun any good? No. Alright. Sorry. We're not taking forever with this. Okay. Moving on. Oh, also, my hat must be dyed. But as I promised, uh, if if it's gonna, something that's gonna take forever, I'll do it off camera. But that's that. We're moving on. <laughs> Didn't take any time at all. Oh, we have a lot of waypoints to explore in the Black Citadel. I'm not making much progress on that, but that's because we're doing the story. Oh, who's standing inside me? Who's this? Nick's Death Stare. And he's got some fabulous hat. Hat action going on here. Yeah, I like his outfit a lot. I don't want that. I mean, I just got, like, this the basic armor, which, I mean, is, is okay. But uh, it gets kind of boring, because it's all the same. All right, let's go in. Oh wow, right here at this waypoint. Take like no time at all. Back to the plains of Ashford, which we've just about uh, got 50% on, I think. Lots of waypoints to go and and point of interests, and we've only done a single skill challenge and zero vistas. But uh, we'll get we'll get we'll get to <coughs> we'll get to that after the story. It's a frog person. Hey, this is miniature. Man, that's that's so small. All right, here we are. Spilled blood. I'm guessing this is like a, a war camp. It looks, it looks like toilet paper or like sticky notes sticking out of the ground. Because of like the, just the painterly brush stroke art style that it is. Spilled blood. Prevent the assassination of blood legions. Reva. Reva, I'm trying to do my commentary here. You're so loud. Fine. I won't talk at all. I'm looking for Rhoda the Quick. I need to talk to her right away. Keep it down. I'm Rhoda. And if these Blood Legion soldiers see us together, they'll know something's up. Nice Three hair. Legion assassins are on their way to kill Centurion Tornpaw, disguised as Iron Legion. We have to warn the Centurion. Centurion Tornpaw's in the command tent. Hmm. Just look for the meanest soldier there, but good luck convincing her she's full of spit and rumble. I'll do my best. Spit and rumble is like my middle name. Or you can follow me, Rhoda, with your white hair. Rhoda the white hair. When our last enemy lies dead oh, at our feet, got a speech and the going on. Steps forward. Which legion will command all others? How do I get in here? Blood, 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 blood. Who's this? Reva, as usual, following me around. I know nothing about her. Supposedly she's my best friend. There's like zero connection there. How do I actually get up here? Do I just say hi? No. Uh, there might be some stairs over here. More of a ramp, really. Alright, Commandant. Or whatever. Centurion. Centurion. Tribune Desigrate. Oh, she does look mean. Warn you. Flame Legion assassins are targeting you for elimination. An Ash soldier? In my camp? Ah, oh, Rhoda. I suspected you were one of Torga's spies. Get out of my sight, both of you, before I pull your teeth and use them as caltrops. Uh. You listening? What? I just said that the Flame Legion has stolen uniforms and equipment to disguise themselves as Iron Man. They're coming to kill you. I heard you, but I'm not Ash Trash. I don't snivel like a scaredy cat at the first sign of danger. Now, tell me their plan. No, but I don't. Huh? War between blood and iron. They think your death will break the Alliance. And they have a well-planned attack coming. You need to be ready. I always am. You two stick around and you'll see. I'll even let you mop up after the fight. Wait, so first you wanted us to leave, and now you want us to stick around? Show them a Blood Legion welcome. What's that supposed to mean? Are they going to try to kill us? Huh? Okay. Oh, let's get ready for the plot twist there. What if, uh, Centurion... Oh, Castor Crushpaw. He's a legionnaire just like me. I want those spiky shoulders. Here come the Iron Legion. It's your force, Blood Legion. Is this a declaration of war? 
Yes. Yeah. War against the Flame Legion, you cowardly lying scum. Prepare to die. Burn me, they're ready for us. Lose the disguise, just attack! I mean, you guys are outnumbered. Time for some spinny action. Maybe a little bit of fury. I'm assuming that hit somebody. It's kinda hard to tell with this camera work. Actually, there are a ton of these guys now. They're running from me, I can't keep up. Uh, if I do this, supposedly that does something. Or just spin my way through them all. No, that actually is a lot of them. What? It's just the Royal Rumble in here. I think more more charming white armor like me. It's easier to see myself. Oh, what a schlot. Schlot, schlot? Strike. My English kind of just falls apart sometimes. I think I might actually know a different language, but I forgot that language. So English is my second language, and yet it's the only language I speak. It's complicated. That's what I tell myself at least, to make myself feel better about how terrible my uh, dyslexia is. Me. Or rather, is it dysphonia? It's dysphonia when you have trouble talking. Dyslexia is reading it, or yeah, something like it. They're all, it's all related though, it's something about misfirings in the brain. It's like a miniature, miniature stroke or something. <laughs> probably not, probably nothing like that. I'm, I'm making that up. But I, I do know that dysphonia is a thing, and it, I probably have it. I mean, I, I just stumble on my words too often for myself to not have it. But uh, I mean, it's comedy, isn't it? Like, if you do that around like maybe your crush or something, um, you know, it's endearing sort of way to get them to start a conversation with you. Like, oh, yeah. I'm so retarded, uh, you, uh, you messed your words up, huh? Yeah, uh, that's me, I uh, wanna go out for coffee or something? Uh, sure, 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 I always wanted to go out with a dysphonic person. And there you go, I mean, the best icebreaker you could possibly hope for. Oh no, we got a dead one. Oh, Caster Rushpaw. That's probably like a terrible use of my time. Actually, I should probably just kill these fools. Whatever. I don't need those two. Caster Crushpaw and his uh, legionnaire friend both bit the iron, as it were, because there's no dust around here. I mean, these people are pretty fearless with their bows, just point blank standing in there. Apparently, I'm attacking a blue crate, or, or not. Who's shooting at us? Is that the Iron Legion's new weapon? And that I think I already failed his task. Well, I should have dodged if I was, you know, a perfectionist, but I'm not. I'm probably not actually even attacking anything. I'm just swinging. Swinging around. Look for the red bars. Probably helps. Don't stand in the red circles. Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice. Uh. And this just goes on and on. Let me tell you. Oh. Goodness, it's over. That was harder than I thought. <laughs> I'm forced to be grateful to Tribune Desert Grave, whether I like it or not. You better like it. Centurion, I'd like to explain. Shut it, Rhoda. How long have you been Torga's pawn? You're a spy and a traitor. You're lucky I don't gut you where you stand. How could you be a traitor? You're on the I same strip you a blood side. Legion rank. You're finished, Gladium. Now get out of here. I'm sorry, Rhoda. I don't know what you're planning to do, but I have an idea. Join my warband. You're loyal enough to out yourself as a spy just to keep the Centurion safe. And that's the kind of soldier I need. Hey, you're the one who had the initiative to stop the Flame Legion. I'd be honored to join your team. Outstanding. Pack up your gear, and I'll see you at the Black Citadel. Oh, this is like the A-Team. I've figured it all out. Oh, some new armor. Oh, what an upgrade. Uh, I, I feel like maybe some vitality would be nice. Well, then again, I don't really notice my health getting that low lately. I guess those ghosts it did, but uh, precision's useless to me. So it's either power or vitality. Uh, uh, it's probably vitality, to be honest. Uh, it's it's tricky. I'm not an expert on the stats, but I, I feel like uh, 
warriors tend to go tanky now. Uh, actually, I was reading up on it, or, or something. Oh look, it's already... Oh, I haven't equipped it, that's why. <laughs> oh look, all different colors, it's all wrong. I gotta, I gotta go do this. And do this. Yes, yes. Hold on. Oh, glad I was paying attention. Alright, this... Unfortunately, that's soulbound. Alright, enough of that. <laughs> I promise I'm trying not to spend too long on this. Uh, do I want the yellow or red? I like the red. Alright, apply, 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 apply. Let's go. We are now going to report to Tribune Desert Grave at the meeting location. Of course. What is an event going on? What is this event? Eh, I try not to do events when I'm doing the story. I mean, it's good for experience and all that, but I'm in no hurry. Oh, is she back at the, at the scrapyard? Have some imagination, Desert Grave. Never the same meeting place twice, right? Tiova. Tiova. Whoa. I was wondering what was going on. Everything's back now. Okay. Bit of a loading issue. I have this on my SSD, so there shouldn't be too many loading issues, but there you go. Maybe it was a network connection. Because, I mean, I can understand my network being garbage and not loading stuff. That that reason. But uh, if it's already on my SSD, it should, shouldn't be an issue. But whatever. Not gonna worry about it. Blah, 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 blah. Suspe uh, what? Oh no! Desert Grave's been killed. It was all a ploy by the Blood Legion to kill the Ash Legion. Mm -hmm. I figured it all out. Oh, is that is that my boys over there? Or who, what's going on here? Even. Here's our prey. Yeah, just like a thought. Just like Tribulus said, he knows every tailwag you must make before you do. Ha! Where's Tribune Desert Grave? How did you fanatics get this far into the Citadel? Don't give away your weaknesses. Ah. How they got in doesn't oh, matter. It's what matters is how they're leaving. In pieces. Brimstone? What's a blood tribune doing here? Tribulus said this was strictly an Ash Legion arc. Tribulus was wrong. To arms! I'm so confused! But whatever, we're gonna kill everybody. It's too much deception. Too much subterfuge. Not enough. Bashing and whacking. Too easy. Well, I bet Desert Grave's dead, though. The mission has developed a hiccup. No way, Sakia. A hiccup? More like tuberculosis. Eh, uh, TB, uh, funny, huh? Been taken hostage. Uh. Griefblade captured Fengar and tortured him to get information on the Tribune. I knew it. Fengar's useless. Now he'll torture the Tribune to get what he can from her. I know flame troops are mustering near the ruins of Rin. That's where they took her. Where we must go. Sakia, you know too much about the wait flame legion. Dark. I don't trust That'll you. I'll give you time to gather a strike force to back us up, Tribune. Then, under cover of darkness, we sneak and you storm. Reckless, audacious, risky too. Huh. I like it. Yeah. I'll be on your tail when I have the troops to back your play. Good luck, Legionnaire. See, Ridlock loves me. I'm, I'm the cat he always wanted to be when he was my age. That's right. Uh, all right. Leaving this instance then. Rescue Tribune Tribune Desert Grave. It's probably the last bit of the story. Uh, shall we get started on this, or is this episode over? I think the episode might be over. It's been just about 30 minutes. Oh yeah, so... I didn't get to do... Blah, 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 blah. Let me... English. So, if you've been watching my channel... Channel... Gosh, the dysphonia is, is, is awful today. Uh, you'd have noticed that uh, I'm no longer doing three episodes of this week. As of last week. Maybe the week before. I can't remember exactly. But I'm also I'm now doing a series on Ori and the Blind Forest. Newish game came out like I guess about a month ago at this point, but uh, I started my series on it about half a month ago, I guess, or two weeks ago. So that's half a month. Anyway, 
that's going up three times a week. So I'm, I've kind of figured out my my channel, uh, how it's going to work at this point. Uh, I'll have long series, really really long series, like Guild Wars or really big RPGs. I want to do a Dragon Age Origins uh, series because uh, I love that game, sort of, but I never really beat it. And uh, this is like my motivation to actually play games that I otherwise wouldn't play. Um, so, I don't know how long this Guild Wars series will go on, and I might mix and match, you know, and it can be off and on, and, and oh, something interesting happened, because at some point, particularly when, like, the story's over, I'll just be doing, like, dungeons, I guess. That's, and that, like, it'd be cool for, like, one video for each dungeon or something, but I'm not gonna, like, constantly put up dungeon videos. That's just gonna be kind of silly. So, at some point, this person story will finish, and all the other story content I'll maybe do. Um, the living story goes on and on and on and on and on. Unfortunately, I missed the first season of that, so unless I wanted to pay for it, I, I wouldn't have access to it. But the ongoing living story, I could, I guess I could take part of. And that'd basically be the continuation of the series, but at some point, the series <clears throat> will reach a point where there's just not enough content to have regular videos for it. Because I'm not just going to do da daily dungeon or stuff, or just like what record myself doing dailies. Because I mean that'd just be boring for one, and very repetitive for two. So you know, at that point, I'd switch over to another longer series <clears throat> of of another RPG sort of thing. Uh, and of course, I can upload uh, dungeons at, at least once, and you know, stuff like eh, one on one off videos sort of for this. And then I'm doing shorter series uh, three times a week to get them through quickly, like so the Ori. In the Blind Forest game. <clears throat> that should be done sh sh soon, I imagine. I'm, re I'm really bad at that game. I'm really bad at games in general, for the most part, except for, uh, you know, easy games. I'm good at those. Who isn't, right? But, uh, so three, vid three videos a week for the shorter series so that I can actually chew through those and, and kind of play through this backlog of Steam games I've had. Um, after that, maybe, like, uh, I don't know. We'll find out. We'll see. Or, yeah. And then, of course, on Saturday, I'm doing my League of Legends weekly video, which well, would be educational, sort of. I mean, if you're, if you're worse than me at League of Legends, which, I mean, takes some effort to be worse than me, you might learn something. Otherwise, it's, I'm sure it's entertaining if you just like to listen to rambling. So I'm, that's my forte, rambling. Hello, Ash Legion Soldier. My helmet is cooler than yours. Ugh! It's a cub! Alright, so that's this episode. Over. I'll see you guys next time as we rescue Tribune Desert Grave.